Yeah, it's your boy Fist in the his house, bringing another great edition of Modern Warfare 2. Not YouTube for you, because hey, that's what I do. Anyways, uh, yes, this is the next video in the series of uh, Wings of Redemption, Rings of Redemption, and Fist of Cuffs. And actually, it's 24 videos. In this video, um, these are one of my negative videos. So you actually get to see Fist of Cuffs as human. I go negative. Oh my god. Ha ha. No, I mean, obviously, uh, anybody who tells you anything other than they never went negative, they're full of shit. It's just that it's just that simple. Unless you have a 1000% kill death ratio, 1000 then <laughs> you have had had to die or had to go negative at some point in your gameplay. And um, this is my first time re-watching this video. I didn't even know where the mistakes I made. And uh, that's where it was. This guy got behind this, um, this uh, uh, heater condenser uh, conditioning unit. I mean, it's not obviously. It's cold out. It's a heating unit. He got behind a heating unit, and uh, I kept banging my head up against the wall, you know, and silenced SM... Uh, assault rifle versus a pinpoint m16 and i try to rocket him out of here and i guess um i try to be i was trying to be rambo for some reason but at any rate uh, i was doing my part on the team and holding him down i guess but i don't know <laughs> and uh, finally i killed the guy and i mean it was like as you can see i'm fighting for inches here and that's probably you know you know, you can see my gameplay. I mean, obviously, I like to move forward. And these guys were held up in the computer room, and uh, there's just no way of getting to them. I mean, I mean, obviously, I hit them with the rockets, uh, grenades, just at the wrong place at the wrong time, uh, all game long. And I'm sure it happens to most of you guys. I mean, that's just the way it goes. Uh, you know, <laughs> that's the way it is. You know, you just you're like, okay, I tried from going from the left, it didn't work. I tried rocketing people, it didn't kill nobody. You know, you get... That's the thing, when you're playing with a group of good players and they're attacking, you get put out of the rotation. When you get put out of the rotation, it's like you're out of the rotation of the UAV. You're out of the rotation of where your team is going. So it's like literally not making excuses for myself, but this is what happens. You know, teammates, your enemy just spawns right where you're at, and you don't even see them, and you get killed. And uh, I made some poor decisions in this game. I mean, if anything, you guys can learn from it, because, like I said, I'm a day late, a second short on every kill. So, you know, and then go back to my other point, you know. If you haven't gone negative, then you're, you're just full of shit. That's the bottom line. And, uh... My kill death ratio is 2.01, legit, and um, strictly all team death match, mostly. And yet, and the thing, the reason why my kill death ratio, I mean, you guys probably see a lot of my scores. Like, look at that shit, you know? <laughs> what the fuck? You come around the corner and the guy's just laying a claymore and he gets lucky on you. But the point I'm trying to make is that. You know, I, I when I played the game in the beginning, um, they said they were going to reset the leaderboards. So I did a lot of fucking around in the beginning of uh, the game when it first came out. So, I mean, it's really hard to bring your kill-death ratio up when you got a lot of kills and a lot of deaths. So, that right there, you know, I, you see a lot of my videos where I got a lot of good scores. My kill-death ratio should really be between... A legit 230 to 240, 50 somewhere in there. If I didn't screw around when I first got the game on Xbox Live, you know, because I believe everything that Robin Boland said, but you know. So I wind up going six and eight with my shitty score. Wings went 19 to two. Hope you enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for the next one. Peace, your boy Fist. I'm out.